Hey guys, this is Lake, and I'll be showing you how to use FTP or File Transfer Protocol on your Pro HD camera. In this video, I'm going to be using a QNAP network attached storage device. To start off, I'm going to open up Mozilla Firefox and log in to my QNAP network attached storage device. Once logged in, I'm going to navigate to my file directory. Once the file directory has loaded, I will navigate to the subfolder where I'm going to be saving the content for my Pro HD camera. And at the top here, this will be my file path. It'll be recordings, FTP, and then Pro HD. Now I'm going to open up a new tab, bring up the IP address of my Pro HD camera, and log in. Once logged in, I'm going to head over to the top right corner where it says Setup and click that option. Now I'm going to navigate to the left side tabs and select storage and then destination. Once in the destination field you'll notice path on the top. The current path is the SD card. We're going to be changing that to FTP or file transfer protocol. Now let's head back to path and then select FTP instead of SD card. Once this has been selected, we will move down and select Save. Now we'll go up to the FTP menu and we will select Enable. Now I'll type in the server address. This will be the IP address of the QNAP network attached storage system. Now I will type in the port number. The normal port numbers for FTP are 21 or 22, unless otherwise stated. Now we'll type in my username, and then my password. Now I will type in remote directory, which will be recording, followed by a forward slash, FTP, followed by a forward slash, and then ProHD. The file paths are case sensitive. You need to input the file path exactly as shown in the NAS. Please note, it is not necessary to put a forward slash at the beginning of the directory file path. So now I'll go and click save. Once this save has been made, I will navigate to the QNAP NAS. I'm going to refresh the file directory. Once this has been refreshed, you will notice that there are new files being populated on the drive. This right here will be the serial number of your camera. Now we're going to open this folder. And under the folder, you'll notice that it'll have the current day's date on it. This folder will contain all of the recordings for that particular day. Inside the next folder will be JPEGs and DAV. The JPEGs will contain the snapshots that you have set recorded on your camera. All of these are going to be the snapshots that your camera has recorded via motion detection. The next folder is the DAV folder. The DAV folder will contain all of the scheduled video recordings. And this will conclude how to set up FTP on the Pro HD camera. Again, my name is Lake, and I hope you have a great day.